Hey, what's up you guys? Uh, Keely was going to do this. Um, she's going to tell you the story of, uh, of her engagement. Uh, but she's engaged. She's, got, she's busy. And so I just decided that I would do it for her. Uh, so here we are, the side of the crime. And now I'm Keely. Oh my goodness, I'm going to go. And I don't have a lot of time to do this either. I'm going to go and I got to go help my friend babysit for their housewarming party. Okay, here we are. The gate is opening. The gate is opening. Oh my gosh, it's my friend. Oh, hi Luke. How are you? Oh, April. I'm so, so surprised to see you. Oh wait, I need to come up here. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so now, now Luke is telling me that he's got, so there's something about how this isn't about my story. This isn't about, about, I don't know, this is for me, and I'm really confused. I don't know what's happening. I don't know why I had to park my car. I don't know what to do. And then all of a sudden I come around this corner, and there's the house. And at the house, I see Lee and Beth Wilson. And they're like, hey, and dressed up all nice. And I'm confused. I don't know what to do. I'm not dressed up all nice. And they're right there. And Lee, he starts telling me something about marriage. He uses the M word. I just don't. My mind is reeling. I don't know what's happening. I'm so confused. And then Beth starts talking and telling me advice for being a, a wife. And I'm just, I don't know. And I'm coming and I'm coming. And then I get to right under this tree right here. And right up there on this bench, I see somebody. I don't know who they are. Uh, and here, he's standing right here on that bench. David Maddox! David Maddox, oldest friend in the world. He gives me like a 10 minute sermon. It's so great. It's so wonderful. But then we gotta go. And then Caro's there too, his wife. And we're best friends, like BFF. And she started crying. I started crying. It got real emotional. And then we got to right here this bench and that's where Lane and Preston was and he just prayed for me they all prayed for me and after they got him praying for me there were candles lining up and I just I had to go this way alone because it was only for me and so I had to follow the candles down this way and I didn't know what to expect and I didn't know and I was so nervous I'm so nervous because I knew it was coming. I knew it. I knew that he was going to propose to me. And he did. Look at my ring. I love him. Bye.